what I saw last night is a team that's got some pieces that are getting better. Um, I really thought Miles played well on both ends last night. Was active, made some really good plays at times when Alabama needed it. Uh, Nate Oates sat J.D. Davison last night because he didn't know who he was guarding for about six minutes. And in the midst of that's when the technical happened. And J.D. came back like gangage and it was both ends. You know, we talked about that a couple of weeks ago to where when J.D. gets going on both ends, on defense, he was rebounding the ball, he was getting out and running, making passes, offensive rebounds. And Rojas, again, you know, not wonderful minutes, but serviceable. You know, he went 10 deep last night. Um, and, and, and then kind of just pick and choose and looking for different rotations. But I think you're seeing Alabama. Nate Oates has got a lot of working parts, and he's, and he's kind of tweaking some different here, there, trying to find the right lineup. I don't think he's found that lineup that he really, 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 really trusts yet, like with five guys. He's still kind of piecing it by game, but they're trending and getting better. They've won the game. They've won three in a row, games that they needed to win. Hasn't been pretty. But just like Florida, you're winning. You know, or Florida did before last week. You're winning those games. I, Pat, I'd say Alabama's a, you know, five to seven seed, you know, plus or minus one, um, that would be very, very, very dangerous against a team that you got in like a three seed or a two seed if you caught them in the second round. Um, but they, they're resilient. Um, and they got their coaches back last night. And what a great, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm obviously a state guy, but how good for those Alabama assistant coaches, man? Um, yeah. You know, not don't get a lot of recognition, and they were engaged, and they were into it, man, after Nate left. And so I just wanted to give a shout-out to Pat and all those guys. I've known, known him a long time, and it's good to see them um, really get intense. And another thing, like we talked about, that Alabama crowd was great last night. There wasn't a lot of them there, but, man, they got that team going at, at, at the end of the game. So Alabama's trending back upward. 